the next thing to do is make hay off that little field and sell that then we got money to get us through until the silage is ready to sell so I'll go ahead and mow head windrow to make hay out of this other field here get all that sold then we can move on in time until that silage I'm thinking next month next month if not next month definitely the month after that silage will be ready to sell it'll be ready to sell before we need to harvest grass again that'll let us know if we uh, need to keep the little field as hay or if we can sell the tether and the forage wagon and just make silage but I think it's, I think we're gonna end up getting a decent return so let me get this done and then I'll catch back up to you when it's time to sell the silage
Right, here we are. See what we make off of this. Back on to the grate. Get rid of the straps. Nope. Get rid of the straps. There we go. Made $32,502 off that load. That's pretty good. I think I made 8000 off of the hay on the small field. I know we ended the day yesterday with 10000 So that was plenty enough. We're at 41000 right now. Definitely would like to upgrade um, to a baler with a wrapper. We can. They're fairly expensive, huh? 78,000. You don't wrap, do you? Oh. 78,000, the cheapest one with a wrapper. We may have to do the whole process again. To um, make enough money to afford a baler with a wrapper on it. Do, do, do. Yeah. Well, we can get a quick bail for 60000 So that's only 20000 off. So if we do that whole process again, we would be able to afford quick bail and then maybe also a bail loader. That's 50000 That's expensive. Everything is so expensive these days. Uh, let me see what we would get for... Um, what would we be swapping out? That would be our baler for 14. And then we could get rid of the forage wagon. That's four grand. Almost five grand back. On the tether. Six, seven, eight thousand. I mean, we're fairly close right now. We actually have logs too. So we could do that. We could sell our baler, our bale wrapper, our forage wagon, and our tether, and a truckload of logs, and upgrade to a baler with a wrapper. Because that would save a lot of time and energy. So we'll probably do that in the next episode. We'll do that. We'll upgrade and then we'll mow and windrow and bail with the wrapper and see how much faster that process is and at that point we'll uh we'll be doing silage on both because i think we've got we should have plenty and if not after we buy the new baler we may have to sell another load of logs just to make sure we have money for the for our expenses for the day for the month the the loan payment and the property maintenance expenses and stuff but that will be next time it'll be what we do get ourselves a little bit better equipment get that all swapped around and then do another silage run on both fields, see what we make off of that, see if we can upgrade our equipment even further, because what I would like to have is, eventually I'd like to get a, I don't know where to park this trailer, it's a little big for everything, um, eventually I'd like to get a tractor that has a uh, three point on the front PTO on the front as well and get an upgraded set of mowers there's a pottinger set that will swath as you mow so it'll just mow it and put it all in a big line so you only have two steps you mow and then you bail that not that 
windrowing takes a long time, but it is another step. That would get rid of that step. It would be mow, bale, load, and sell. Just pretty much as simplified as you can make that process. Um, the only alternative is to put a mower on the front and a baler on the back and mow and bale in one step. But I think that probably takes longer because even though you're only going over a field once, the pickup on the baler, you're mowing such a narrower path at a time that it's longer on the field than it would be to just do the field twice. I think feels like I don't know we'll find out at some point uh, how fast we can make this process of course we're still going to have to wait for silage to ferment but the actual field work process we can make pretty quick and the faster we can make that the easier it'll be to make decent money to buy a plot of land and some logging equipment because logging equipment and land is expensive that we need to make decent money off this land that we have. But we're getting there. A little step at a time. Getting a little better each time we do stuff. So that's awesome. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I will see you next time when we upgrade some of our equipment again. And I hope you have a great day. Bye.